everyone. Sorry for the delay. Um, hopefully this stream works now, but uh, live stream wasn't working earlier. Uh, welcome back to another Coffee with Shade. We are going to be picking up some pollens today and seeing what these look like in person. I have no clue what they're going to look like in person. And um, we are see here about 10 minutes away and good morning Jay good morning GT sorry coffee with shades a little late and delayed on my old stream something going on weird with live streaming this morning but here we are picking up some Air Jordan 1 pollens no strap Travis Scott's yes how did everybody do yesterday on the Travis Scott Hopefully you were able to tune in and see me on Unbreakable yesterday. He was fortunate enough to snag a W on the Sneakers app, so I'm sure he's still probably screaming right now this morning. Happy with joy that he was able to cop one of those. I'm going to be picking up some pollen today. For those of you who don't know, it sounds like there was a lot of shipping delays and unfortunately a lot of stores did not receive the pollens in store. So I think we're gonna be seeing a lot more stock online, specifically for Foot Locker. Um, hopefully, if you're going for it on the Seekers app, you're able to cop it. Let me know who's going for the pollens this morning. I know it's definitely an acquired taste with the black and yellow, but a lot of people are actually comparing them to the Wu-Tang uh, Dunks from 1999. Good morning, Kendall. What is up Chris Moses what's my opinion on the ones I actually don't mind the yellow and black colorway um, I'm excited to see them in person to see what the quality looks like I'm gonna be picking up a GS pair this morning so I do know that it sounds like stock is gonna be pretty hefty for the adult sizing What's good, Derek? What's up, Scott? Hiking the Scottish Highlands. Just got your notification. You're hiking in Scotland right now and you're on with me on live? That is dedication. Appreciate that. Uh, so again, thanks for everybody who's hopping in. This is Coffee with Shane and I am venturing out in the city right now. About to pick up a pair of some Air Jordan 1s. Good morning, Lord Blackwood. Good morning, Daniel. One of those shoes you got to see in person. Yes, definitely going to have to see these in person. So all of you are going to get a sneak peek of what these look like in hand. I will definitely, what's up, Malika? Good to see you in here. Um, we're going to be taking a sneak peek at these. I'm going to unbox these here in a minute after I pick them up in store let you all see them in hand and have some opinions on what the material looks like in person and hopefully these uh look fresh i don't know i think a lot of people are kind of you know a little tired from yesterday's full day experience with uh, the travis scotts i think the quality will be nice too we'll see happy saturday digitally handmade good to see you all in here I did win a raffle, JJ. So this is Coffee with Shay, where I'm picking up one of my raffles, just showing all of you my adventures in New York and you know what it takes to be a shoe tuber. You gotta grind and pick up shoes and enter as many raffles as possible. The leather better be supple. We'll see, Daniel. I have no idea. Ah. Uh, Moses. I know. A lot of L's yesterday, unfortunately, but um, hopefully you were all able to tune in to see me on Unbreakable. He was able to cop a W. I won a raffle as well for the Travis Scotts. Um, I won't be too excited till I actually get an email confirmation, though, that those are being shipped over. You never heard of Travis Scotts. I know, Lord Blackwood. I don't know who has heard of Travis Scotts before. What is my opinion on the Nike Cortez LA? Um, I don't mind them actually, the Nike Cortez. I think it's a good cop for sure. Ah, you gotta get yours from s, s so you won a raffle too, JJ. Congratulations for all of you who took some W's on raffles today. Cleveland always in here. What's good, Capomatic? <laughs> yes, Lord Blackwood. Brought some luck to Unbreakable yesterday. For those of you who missed out, be sure to go and tune back in. 
What's up, Joseph? Always in the streets. The cow in the house. Check zombie. There is going to be. Um, there was a fair amount, Daniel Martin. Um, maybe not so much in my size specifically. I feel like the highest stock was a size nine, nine and a half. Unfortunately, that's just a little too big of a sizing for me. What is up, Vietnamese? The cow in the house. Thank you. It's still drying, everybody. My hair is still kind of slightly wet, but it's going to be 90, 90 degrees. And I'm wearing this lovely shirt here. What's up, Josephine? Thanks so much for supporting the channel. Glad to have you all in here. We are just chilling. Marius Johnson. What's up, Go and Ghost? Marius Johnson. Hope you're doing well. You hit on reserve ones yesterday. Oh my God. Congratulations, Marius. Thank you for the donation. Really appreciate all your support to the channel. What size are you? You're 5.5 youth. I am a seven. Why? Waiting on your Levi's? You got the Levi's? Ah, those are beautiful. The Levi's 992s are beautiful. I'm so jealous that you got those. Um, stock was pretty low. For those of you who missed out on me being number 45 and not being able to cop a pair of those Levi's New Balance shoes makes no sense to me. Jordan 1 Low Starfish, a must cop. Did you see my, my video on those? I'm not quite sure what the name is. People are now calling them starfishes when, you know, some people are calling them shattered backboards, but they are beautiful. Definitely recommend going after those. I think the quality is pretty top par. We're in the heat city right now, everybody. Literally, the amounts of people rolling in down here is insane. I avoid this area at all costs. All you locals who come to the more crowded areas in New York, it, it's not not really what happens when you live in New York City. You try and stay away from the more populated regions, but here we are in the grind. Go and ghost. You're not in NYC anymore? Where'd you go? Everyone be able to be sure to hit that like if you have not already on this video, and if you're not subscribed, subscribe. We got a ton of heat coming out. That shattered backward Air Jordan ones are called Starfish. I don't know about that name, but whatever. I think everybody's a little confused with the orange color scheme, and pictures are kind of deceitful right now as, as far as what color people think they are. Nothing like NYC. Oh, you moved to Florida. Florida's nice too, though. I lived in Florida for almost a year. I didn't quite make it. Didn't quite make it a full year. Maybe it was because I was living in the, the heat of it in South Beach. Way too much partying for, for Miss Shade, so had to get out of that place. Couldn't be up all night. Mom was starting to call me a vampire. And you can get random color with the denim on the Levi 992. That's the most exciting thing. Yeah, I mean, it's like you just don't know what, what you're gonna get denim wise. I mean, it's, it's such a cool collab. I'm so sad I was not able to cop that. You gotta fill in the pollens are gonna be really easy to get, not high resale, what do you think? Um, <laughs> Lord Blackwood, I am still up all night. Who am I kidding? Uh, I, you know, I don't know what the resale is going to be like. I do know that stock was delayed in store. So a majority of that stock is going to be online. Uh, I do know that, you know, there's going to be a pretty hefty amount of stock for adult pairs in the thousands. So, you know, I don't think that people are going to have as many issues trying to copy as maybe they did yesterday with the Travis, <laughs> Travis's. But I'm sure there was, you know, around like, few million people on the Seekers app bombarding it yesterday. Yes, I have been going non-stop, Daniel. That's that's what the, the shade train is is doing lately. We are, um, we're going non-stop. We're grinding up until Sneaker Con. So hopefully all of you tune in. I'm going to be going live a lot. We got some people I'm excited to meet. Jacob Starr. Um, hopefully going to be able to connect with him for the first time. Uh, I have not gotten an early pair of the Lightning Fours yet, but you already know. As soon as I get early pairs, I'm pumping that content all out for you. I was fortunate enough to be blessed with uh, some early pairs for the Air Jordan 1 Low Shattered Backboards. So thank you again, Jordan, for sending me those way my way, but you never know. Every month, you know, who knows what's going to show up in the mailbox, and I'm excited to show you all the shoes that I receive figured out what I'm going to wear, Lord Blackwood. 
Um, you know, I think I may have to go live. So for those of you who don't know, I'm going to actually be putting it up today, but I'm going to be going live with Jacques Slade on Tuesday before I head out on my trip. And uh, I did not cop those from Extra Butter yesterday. Um, oh, thanks, CJ Lee. So I um, am going to be talking to Jacques, and I want all of you to tune in and help me pick out my outfits for my entire week that I'll be out and about in LA and San Francisco. So you guys can choose what you think I should wear to SneakerCon this time around. Definitely put your votes in for the sneakers you think I should be repping over there and the fits that I should be pairing with the shoes. I'm crossing my fingers that my Travis Scott's come in before I leave because I'm going to be really freaking out the entire time I'm gone that something's going to happen to them. Oh, check zombie. You're in lockdown again. Where are you at? Australia? Breads and <laughs> dress up shade. Yes. All right. So the draw is now officially open. So for those of you who are going for the pollens, good luck. Let me know when you start taking those W's. Hopefully all of you get W's today. Prince of Judah, here you go. Yeah, here's a little sip for you. I barely drank this. I need it. I'm so exhausted today, everybody. I'm not going to lie to you. The shade needs energy. I appreciate it, Lord Blackwood. So hopefully I'll get, um, you know, the mail out. How many pairs of Travis's you got, Shade? I actually don't have that many pairs of Travis Scott's. I have three pairs, which, you know, it's not too crazy. Did you win the Travis Fragments, Lucas? I did. I won a raffle, Lucas, on the Travis Fragments, uh, Jordan. So, hoping that that confirmation that they've been sent out comes through here soon. So, fingers crossed. I've also got a lot of heat that just... Uh, came in this week. I don't know how much time I'm going to have to shoot it all, but um, got some exciting stuff from eBay, so you'll have to stay tuned to that. Ah, thanks, Lucas. Appreciate it. J. Dot. I try. I enter as many raffles as possible. I'm telling you, everybody, if you are in a city that has raffles, enter as many as you can. I did not cop the rain clouds. Ugh. I love me some, some new balances though. I have not yet hit on the 50 dunks yet, Ryan. I can't believe how limited those are. Apparently I'm not using my sneakers up enough since that seems to be the way they're setting up the aggregator system. You have to be just on that app 24 seven, but um, I feel like I am on that app 24 seven, except right now because I'm going live with you guys right now. Check Zombie, I think people are always tired of the sneakers app, to be honest with you, especially when you start taking, you know, L's left and right. Uh, but again, we are gonna be showing you some shoes here shortly. What's up, slash rocker54? We've confirmed that activity literally makes no difference on sneakers app, yeah. The barrier, we are about Air Max Plus and Air Force One quick strikes. They gotta be limited or not well known. Ah, that makes sense, Seely. Stuck on CAPTCHA, Daniel Martin? I hate CAPTCHAs. Ah, the Kyrie's prints, nice. Thank you, Frank. You know, honestly, Marius, I really thought that there was gonna be more stock for these dunks. I didn't know that, you know, I knew there was gonna be a catch with them launching um, 50 dunks. So, here's the catch, I guess, right? We have to get access in order to be able to, to even go for them. I honestly don't know a lot of people who have actually won a pair of those dogs. I really wanted uh, number 50 or number one, actually, but now I could care less, really. I just am not as excited about the recent colors that have been dropping, but, you know, I'm not gonna say no, I guess, if Sneakers app blesses me with, you know, access to purchase one. But uh, it's basically like winning the lottery these days on the Sneakers app. I don't really think that any of us have the exact outline of how to win shoes on there consistently. I mean, the Wu-Tang Dunks are fire. I would probably... <laughs> Konnichiwa! There's my Japanese. I'm very limited on Japanese, sorry. Uh, but I can, I can write you back and message you back in, in Japanese. Uh, but I love the 1999 Dunks. I think that all of the Wu-Tang collabs have done super well, specifically resale price point. 
Uh, yeah, basically Lord Blackwood. But I really like the Wu-Tang dunks when they came out in 1999. I think that these are kind of the closest variation, even though these are ones. Yeah, I think a lot of people wanted wanted the same ones that we all wanted, Marius. Um, but hey, we still got a lot more dunk opportunities, I guess. We can look at it on the bright side and think that, you know, we've got a lot more dunks that we could potentially cop. What's up, Klutz? Uh, yeah, so good to see you in here, Neil. What is my favorite secret release of 2021 so far? Um, you want to pair? Let's see. <laughs> it's true, Daniel. People didn't think I played collegiate volleyball. Favorite pair this year? I mean, I love the Amam and Air Threes. I think obviously the Travis Scott Fragment Jordans are some of the most hypest that have released this year. I love the Shalehi Bembry. New balances have dropped. Um, it's a lot of shoes. I may have to do just a recap video of like all my top 10 picks so far. I can't believe we're almost in the middle of August though. So time is flying. We're almost to the end of summer. I'm excited. For sure. Definitely a grail ride have to agree with you on that one but uh you know there's a lot of interesting sneakers that dropped this year that i'm obsessed with you bought three pairs of travis fragment lows to hold them for a while worth or not i mean i don't know they could potentially go up travis's do maintain you know their price point on the resale market bunny space jam's nice uh, I'm so bummed I honestly didn't go for those Air Force One Lola Bunnies. I saw them on feet and I think they're so fire. What is up, Joker Harley? Good morning to you. Happy to have you in here. Summer is coming in Australia. I forget that um, Australia is opposite. You guys are flipped season-wise. It's like I went there and I remember I went there in the, the winter time and I'm pretty sure it was flipped. Interesting. We are about to go over and pick up some sneakers here. I'm going to show you guys a sneak peek. Yeah, I don't think anybody's going to lose money on those for sure. You got a personal pair. What is up, Cutter? Good to see you all in here. Thank you so much for joining me again for another Coffee with Shades. You hit on the dunks, Ruby. Congrats. Ah, thanks, Distinguish confirmation appreciate it appreciate all your compliments so i'm going to be showing you momentarily hopefully fingers crossed there's no drama going on um some of the air jordan one collins that is for sure just like i was rocking case swiss when i was in high school mom wouldn't allow me to buy jordans they were too expensive and i had to use a discount i had to use that nordstrom's discount you know Everybody was wearing fresh Jordans, and I could only I could only dream that uh, one day my mom would buy me a pair. But fortunately, she was like, "That's too high above my price point." Yep, this is definitely a vibe, Lord Blackwood. I just want you guys to know that this is for real. I'm a New Yorker. I'm in the city. What is going on, Kai? Good to have you in here, girl. Um, this is it. This is the life of a sneaker YouTuber. You know, going out for shoes on the early mornings. Rocking the British Knights. Okay, Joker Harley. Hello from the Congo Brazzaville. All right. I love the diversity that we get in here. I love seeing everybody coming, hopping in from all over the world. Times Square, yep. Better the food in NYC. Pizza, Edward. Oh my God, pizza. Yep, definitely. <laughs> she adds out to enter 50 raffles for sure, Lord Blackwood. I mean, listen, I'll be a... Uh, <laughs> I am coming to LA actually. I'll be in LA coming this week. Walmart shacks. Backdoored on you. I'm dead. <laughs> oh no, you're from Chicago. Chicago has deep dish. I like deep dish too. Oh god, Dallas barbecue. You can't beat it. I can eat barbecue all day. I think tacos, pizza, and barbecue are probably like my top cuisines I love eating. Obviously, I love Filipino food. Memphis, Tennessee. 
LA is expensive, but it's not as expensive as New York. And the traffic, my God, the amount of money I invested in my vehicle out there was insane. We're talking about Payless shoes, Lord Blackwood. I was rocking some Payless shoes too, if that's what you mean. <laughs> Honestly, I don't even know where all the Payless has gone. I feel like there were more of them to buy shoes at. Good luck to you as well. Yes, good luck everybody. Let me know if you are getting some W's or not. Um, we shall see how this draw ends up. I mean, word has it that stock, you know, is pretty high. So we'll see if that's true by seeing how many W's are in this chat. Payless right up until 2004 when I bought my first pair of Nikes for my own money. Lord Blackwood, I was with you. Payless was definitely, you know, the spot. If my mom was like, okay, we just need you to get you a quick pair of shoes that you're gonna throw away soon. <laughs> CJ, the, the ride that I roll in right now, it's called that MTA subway. Hopefully you guys can see me on the Supreme one. I don't know if you saw images leaked, but Supreme is teasing us. They literally hyped out a subway with Supreme all over it, and it's the L train. You get it, you guys? The L train. The L train. May the sneakers God be with you and to you. Uh, so Supreme is basically saying, yeah, we put our branding on the L train so you guys are all going to take an L. So um, I'm excited to find this L train. They're really messing with us. They don't really give a shit, apparently. <laughs> so that's why they decided to put on the L train, no other train. What up, E. Williams in the house? Do they charge more for Supreme L, LOL? Maybe it's more expensive to take that train because it's all decked out Supreme. <laughs> Pretty much, Antonio. I love Harlem, Prince of Judah. I, there's some great food in Harlem. For those of you who have not been here, do not skip out on Harlem. They got some great, great food. <laughs> Walking W. Until I get on that L train, apparently. I guess that's a, that's sending out a message that I don't take W's if you take the L train. But I actually don't take the L train that often unless I have to go to Brooklyn. Australia is heaven. I love Australia. Washington Heights is a sleeper. Washington Heights is great as well. Taking the 7 train, huh? I rarely take the 7 train. That's what? Long Island City. If you're going over to Long Island City. <laughs> it just gives you high traffic area. Oh my god. Bad Bunnies are coming out. I've already entered a bunch of raffles for the Bad Bunnies. I think, honestly, this is the best color that I've seen the Bad Bunnies in. I thought the pink was cool, but black, I mean, come on. You all know how much I love me some black. Love me some all black outfits. Um, so, fingers crossed, I really want those Bad Bunnies. Um, but, uh, you know, who knows? Bad Bunnies have been pretty difficult to get lately. I kind of want mine in, a, in an egg like the other people got theirs, but it might just be in a regular box. All right, everybody. Hopefully, we are going to be seeing some W's coming in here. Seven train is an L, especially if you need to head to work. LMAO. <laughs> uh, biggest L living in NYC. Uh, I just, you know, this L train is really comedic. And I wonder how much it costs them actually to put that on the L train. Oh, my God. Sat. Oh my god. Seriously, CJ? A rat was sipping on her drool and she was passed out in the subway? Handling that human hair very... Yep. I tried, Don. I got the, got the curly hair products in here, but it is very humid. Very, very humid. That's interesting, though, CJ. <laughs> the two train was your train when you lived here. Nice expressway. What shoes are you rocking at the moment? Um, gosh, Daniel, I got so many shoes that I need to post. It's honestly insane. I think I may be posting a Yeezy. I have some Air Jordan 1s on today, actually. Let me just show you guys what I'm wearing here. Give you a little sneak peek. It's one of my favorite summer colorways that we've got going on today. Speaking of drooling, you know, there's a guy over there drooling right now. Do you guys want to, do you want to see it? Do you want to see this guy like actually passed out over there? Can you see? I don't know if you guys can see him in the corner there, but 
There's actually a guy passed out and he's binge ruling. He's been surrounded by pigeons. It's so New York. The grittiness, right? <laughs> grittiness of New York. People passed out because they're either intoxicated or drugged out. I'm not sure which, but um, there's a lot of pigeons around that guy. I think they're eating his drool as well, CJ. Might be a great TikTok video. I just love showing everybody all of the stuff that happens in New York City. I mean, if you don't live here, you're, just, you're really missing out on some grittiness. Does have the Rota? He might, Daniel. <laughs> NYC nightlife. Oh my god, I got I got out of that a while ago due to COVID. <laughs> Take the good with the bad. I do. I know, poor guy. And it's about to be 90 degrees out here. Whew, good thing he's in the shade. Ah, DJ, you were in New York. I think everybody should come to New York and just, you know, test it out for a little bit. See if you like it. <laughs> Get more bang for your buck, LA or South. I mean, New York is expensive, but hey, it's not a bad place to, you know, take a, take a trip to, you know, and visit and see if it's for you. You just never know. But uh, there is a lot of grittiness out here, and things are coming back to life, so I'm seeing tons of tourists. All right, they unlocked. I wanted to show you this thing that tourists do. It's like a, a link lock of hands, and there's like seven people with their arms linked, and they like cover all of the sidewalks so you can't walk through them. That's fleece short sweater shade. <laughs> yeah. Crowded city this is. You gotta just stay away from the busy areas, Chuck. MD. Okay, nice, Ryan. Definitely visit NYC MC Squeeze is gonna go floss Wall Street hedge funds. Yes, Joker Harley, you gotta come out here sometime. <laughs> Kids do that, yes, but this is like a whole, adults do it here too. Have you ever been ice skating at Rockefeller Center? I have not. I've been to Battery Park, I've ice skated there for a photo shoot, and the guy that I was modeling with kept falling and he kept trying to bring me down with him. Bad experience. And, uh, you know, it was pretty, pretty bad. So yeah, I'm gonna head over to the store here shortly and uh, you guys are gonna see some pollens, hopefully. Um, and we are gonna give you guys a sneak peek. We'll see, see how things go. Hopefully you guys are taking some W's on the Seekers app right now. We're just chilling in the city. It is really starting to heat up, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, Ryan, you hit on them. That's how it happens on the Seekers app. I think you should just not want any shoes when you're playing and then you'll get every single one of them. It'll be great, absolutely great. It smells like sunblock. Somebody just walked by me and they literally smell like a bottle of sunscreen. I did hit on a raffle. I was on the wait list and then I hit. You need to hold hands with someone that <laughs> grown ass me. Ryan, I think we've all spent a lot of money. This was this was a big week. You're going to pass and then you jumped on it, DJ. Smart decision. Uh, you took a L on the pollens. I'm telling you, every shoe these days, even if they have high stock numbers, it's still hard to get. What's good, Medic Mike? Good morning. Ah, uh, you're trying to buy better save up DJ save up get that car all right everybody so shoes are very limited at the moment and um, just to let you know where I picked up my shoes they are actually selling saying to not give the shoes out not to give the shoes out are you ready for the moment that we've all been waiting for? Are you ready for it? Here's the box. I have a bent damaged box. That's right. Let me just show you the battle wounds here. So we've got some creasing down there. And, um, you know, a little scraped off paper on the corner. Could be worse. We've seen worse. Much worse, to be honest with you. Whew, that is potent. There are some strong chemicals up in this one, for sure. All right, I'm seeing some nice tumbled le leather here. Wow, they smell nice, I'm not gonna lie. So here we have it. 
Let me know what you guys think about this yellow. They are some strong pollens, literally. I'm, gonna, I'm about to start sneezing over here. Does this not remind you of Bumblebee and Transformers? I don't know why it reminds me of that. Can we like cue in black and yellow song right now? I'm not selling in the Philippines. The yellow is a mustard yellow, for sure. This is really nice quality though, everybody. I'm not lying. Yeah, so we've got the yellow laces that they've tied on here, but I'm gonna check in the box, see if we've got some additional laces. I am addicted to this. I love this smell. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I love the, the smell of a, a new sneaker. And it is still pollen season. So let's just take a look. You know, let me give you guys that close up so you can see this firsthand. It's kind of a mustard yellow that we've got going on here. Nylon tongue. You can see it's like really nice quality tumbled leather on there for sure. Got some suspect people staring at my shoes out here. You guys watch my back, okay? Make sure nobody tries to grab these behind me. <laughs> All right, so let's flip her around, take a look. Really nice, high quality leather. You guys can see how great the tumbled black leather is. Lace swap it with white laces. I could see that. I could really see that. I really like these in hand. I wasn't such a big fan when I saw pictures, but like everyone, this is like really, really nice. And these are actually way more limited than I think we expected them to be. Let's grab the other one out, take a look at it. Okay, so we do have additional laces, everyone. So if you don't want to have the kind of mustard yellow that they put on here, <laughs> yeah. For sure, Lord Blackwood. Use my promo code, Lord Blackwood, on uh, Culture Kings. Get yourself some of those anti-creasers. Just hit on 10.5. Let's go, let's go, let's get it. We're also gonna put white laces on them and they look fire. So yeah, so they also gave us two additional laces here. So we've got it in the white as well as the black. I do think white is probably what I'm gonna lace these up with. What do you guys think? White laces, black laces, congrats. Look at all these W's coming in. What should I lace these with? I didn't even know. White. W on 10.5, go and goes. Black for the cream laces. I don't think these are cream. Yeah, these are, these are white laces. These aren't cream that they gave us. You need the puffy tongue on my dunks. Just didn't hit the same without it. Uh, what price for the new Travis Lowe is decent now? Are you talking about resell right now, John? I might try them with yellow to start, Lord Blackwood. We'll see. Elzar Rust. I like that. I've never heard of Elzar Rust before. All right, so let's just take them both out so we can see both of them in hand. Yellow by day, black at night. Dawn, my God, that's so much work. You want me to lace them for the day and the night? Uh, for resale price, what size? It depends on what size you are as well, John, depending on you know what the price point is gonna go for. So let's just take a look at these. Oh my God, that's hilarious. Some Heinz mustard, right? Or I need like a, I, I need like a mustard shirt. Some Heinz mustard or Grey Poupon, I don't know. <laughs> Pittsburgh ones. What are you guys' thoughts on these? Do you like these? Are you in love with them? Move around. Nine US or 9.5. Actually, I think that's the perfect size to be in, John, just because the highest stock was in those sizes. Let me see if I can look real quick for you, I'll tell you. Yeah, I think these are pretty fire, everybody. I know that there was a lot of hate on these pollens, or maybe it's just the saltiness of not getting the Travises. But uh, they did a good job on the quality on here. Let me just flip this around so you can kind of see them both. <laughs> I don't 
mind the colors. Hate the sealers, but the sealers jersey would kind of go hard. Chris, I would agree with you. No more Jordan ones for you, or you all Jordan one out? Is that possible? It's true. Dunk highs do you have the same colorway. The the Wu Tang has the dunks that came out in '99. What do I smell like? <laughs> I wear Killian for those of you, but I'm not telling you the exact scent of Killian. Cop two pairs today. Congrats to those who cop today. Just giving you a little sneak peek of these, what they look like in person. Hopefully you guys were able to take W's. I'm gonna put one of these away. You know, it's crazy because these are so bright that people are literally like staring at me from like blocks away. I feel like they can see the shoe because I'm holding it, but I'm not hating on this. I think this is a great, great quality shoe. Surprisingly, the leather is like top tier. Elliot Brooks, cop, congratulations. So yeah, for those of you who are getting those W's from the draw, W and toddlers. Did you mean to go for toddlers, Frank? Stay loyal. I'm always loyal to New Balances. I love me some New Balances, but as you all know, I have variety on the channel. I like to talk about all different brands. Today, we are talking about the pollen, so you should hold it like Mufasa. <laughs> Dead. So, yeah, not so bad. Again, we got the three laces on here. Bengal spin staring at you. I know, right? It's like probably somebody is going to like grab this who's a Steelers fan, potentially. I don't know. But we got the W today picked up the in-store raffle and hopefully all of you were able to pick up a W as well on the sneakers app. I'm just chilling, happy with this breeze right now. Everyone, it is so hot in New York. It is literally going to be 90 degrees today. Oh, you and Sitsy. Hmm. I am, I am uh, just trying to stay in the shade, literally. It's always better in the shade. You know, that I think that's going to be my tagline. It's better in the shade. Uh, but we are probably going to be ending here shortly because I actually need to go and shoot these and style these for everybody. So hopefully you have those notifications turned on. Be sure to hit that like if you guys have tuned into Coffee with Shade. If you have any questions right now, be sure to ask away. Still waiting on the sneakers alert. <laughs> Let me protect you. Yeah, you guys got my back. You guys got to be watching what's behind me. It's cooler in the shade, yes. The hype shoe. Oh, sorry, John. <laughs> it's better in the shade, exactly. I think that's my new tagline. It is better in the shade, everyone. New tagline for the channel. Shade the way. Oh, I like that too. Everybody's got some good taglines. You know, care for these, burn down the Jordan ones. I get it, Mike. There's been a lot made in the shade. Okay, all right. I'm leaving it up to you guys to come up with a tagline. Made in the shade is a good one too. If I had any Lord Blackwood, I feel like I need to go shopping right now and get some Wu-Tang stuff just because I think th those dunks were fire. Yes, everybody, smash that like, hit that notification bell if you haven't already. We literally are going to be pumping out mov <laughs> movies, literally movies left and right. Kung Fu, <laughs> security is free. Oh my God, I'm dead. Huh? <laughs> Oh, I love that. CJ, you're hilarious. Could use some Kung Fu yeah, while I'm walking around with these, for sure. Santino with the cute. Appreciate it. So hopefully all of you are having a great weekend. Weather in New York is going to be amazing, except for how hot it's going to be. Just picked up my raffle for the day. For those of you who are wanting a sneak peek, I've just been kind of holding the shoe up for you to see in person behind me. Ah, Malia with the $4.99 coming in. Thanks so much, Malia, for your donation. How you been, girl? It's good to have you in here as always. What size do I wear? I wear a 7 in youth or a 7.5 in men. Not going to lose these babies. <laughs> Pine women don't sweat. I, I really don't sweat, everybody. When I was doing that Nordic truck commercial, they had to spray me with water to make it seem like I was sweating. Like Steven Graham says, smash the hell of that like button. I like that medic bike. I do. It's 
smash that like, smash that subscribe. We are going to be doing a huge giveaway, uh, by the way, everybody, when we hit 30K. We are almost to 30K. <laughs> Thanks, MJ Shades. I am a foot model, actually. But um, anyways, we are doing a huge giveaway at 30K. I'm going to be giving away three pairs of shoes and socks to go with it. So be sure to hit that subscribe. We are hopefully going to hit that after SeekerCon. We'll see. But yeah, I'm going to be giving away three pairs of shoes that were actually seen on TV in the Olympics. That's right. So be able to hit, be <laughs> sure to hit that subscribe button. We're going to be giving away three pairs of shoes, socks to go with it, not shade socks, socks to go specifically with these sneakers. So we are going to be hitting 30K hopefully soon. The sooner we get to it, the sooner I can do this giveaway. I'm going to have some guests come on as well, uh, but definitely I'm going to be giving away three pairs of sneakers. Three pairs of sneakers. Took an L on the pollens this morning. What's new? Monte Carlo. These were way more limited than I think people expected. Chris Young. I will be at SeerCon in San Francisco. For those of you who are going to be there, be sure to stop by and say hello to me. Oh, thanks, MJ Shades. Definitely subscribe. Subscribe. Again, we're going to be doing a huge giveaway. Um, super happy for those who won any of my items I gave away in my last giveaway at 25K, but we're hitting 30K. Congrats again to Roscoe. He hit the big 100K last night. So happy for him. Uh, for those of you who don't know, this whole YouTube lifestyle is very difficult, it's very time consuming, and uh, you know, we're just happy to do it for all of you, for our fans. But we shall see, Daniel, but stay tuned for some Amazon pieces, maybe. We'll see. You know how you feel about getting Debbie on the pollens? You want for them to keep the account active? It's how we gotta do it, Go and Ghost. Big milestone, yes, for Wasco hitting that 100K. So happy for him. It's a huge moment for youtubers when they hit that benchmark so um, just happy to hit that 30k here for us shortly you know we've been doing this just over a year so thank you to everybody who's been with you know shade TV since the beginning I just want to reward all of you every time we hit a milestone so again I'm gonna be giving away three pairs of sneakers as well as socks to go with those sneakers I did. A I actually didn't go for the John Vans, Jan Flacco, but I think that the colorways that they released were fire. We're going to be back on with Supreme for those of you who follow me for Supreme. Supreme is starting back up. We've had our couple months off. <laughs> subreddit, you be killing. Yeah, I'm on subreddit. I'm everywhere on subreddit. If you guys aren't following me on Reddit or on Twitter or on my Instagram accounts, be sure to head on over there at the hype model. You put out great content. Ah, appreciate it going ghost. Really, really appreciate it. Let me just put these up close again for you guys to see if you just hopped in here and you're wanting a little sneak peek on the pollens. Those are all Travis Scott giveaways, right? Right, Dan and Mark. Wink, wink, yeah, right. I, I literally had the hardest time just get being able to snag one for myself and I, I haven't even had it in hand yet so I can't even like say that I got one. I don't want to jinx anything but I'm not saying anything until it's officially in my hands. Uh, but for those of you who are jumping in I'm going to give you again just a little quick sneak peek of you know what the pollens look like in hand so that you can see it. Pretty nice leather quality on these again. Nice mustard color. <laughs> Thanks MJ Shades. Uh, but I think they did a good job with this. You know, I'm not disappointed. I don't have any quality issues going on here. Thanks, CJ. Crazy drop yesterday. I know. Yeah, who hit yesterday on the Travis Scotts yesterday? I, would lo I wish I was holding the Travis Scotts for you guys today, but, you know, consolation prize for those of you who were hoping to get something today. Here's the pollens. You got a W. Yes, Rudy, I forgot. You did get a W. Air Max 1 is all-time best shoe. I love an Air Max 1. I actually love Air Max 90s, too. Air Max 90s were kind of like my go-to Nike for the longest time. I just like the way it looks on feet. Do I like these or the pollen dogs? The Wu-Tang dogs? I like the Wu-Tang dogs 
honestly just because you know it's got like the whole branding on the side but you know I'm not hating on these I feel like 1999 was a long time ago and this is the closest thing we're gonna get for a while I don't think they're gonna be bringing us a new one bought a bunch of the Travis merch and took an L I got some Travis merch too I'm excited Wu-Tang Killer Bees yeah uh, they look like good quality. They are super good quality, Malia. I mean, look at that tumbled leather. It's not bad. Not bad at all. You guys can kind of see this in the natural light. I love showing shoes, by the way, in the natural light, just because a lot of shoes that we see on pictures, it's Photoshop. Shop. This is a 7 Youth Baby 2 Fresh. 7 Youth. Uh, but a lot of pictures don't do justice for the color of a shoe. So it's important that you guys see these in the light so you actually can see what it looks like. Didn't hit on the Travis, but got exclusive access on the Off-White Vega Vlogs. Congratulations, that's still pretty fire. Still pretty fire. So yeah, not hating on these. Oh, from his birthday drop. Brandon, some of those drops take forever. They take like six months for them to send anything off. Literally like six months. Just like the Yeezy coat that I've pre-ordered. My garbage bag. We'll see what that looks like in December. Just cop to like the video. Have a good day, Curly. Aw, thanks. We'll see how my hair looks by the end of the day. You guys will see it in the, the latest video. You're from the best city in the world, the Chiaka, Chicago. <laughs> so yeah, for those of you just hopping in, hit a like. I'm about to sign off here, but thanks so much for tuning in to another Coffee with Shade. I love talking with all of you in the morning, seeing how many W's you were able to take. I know, right? I need I need my Kung Fu master over here that's gonna protect me. Exactly, Ishmael. You need to see these in natural light. I wish companies did more natural light stuff just so you actually see it for what it is so you know what you're buying. Aw, oh, that's a good one, MJ Shade. <laughs> Fat pair of yellow laces on these shoes. Okay, who's that dude behind me? I don't know. There's a big dude, there's a big dude in the screen behind me, that's for sure. It's okay, the guy in the uh, hero truck across from me is gonna protect me. <laughs> Shout out from Brooklyn, what's up? Shade, you feel like I hit on every release? I don't. I'm gonna start doing my L's of the week actually for you guys, just so you know. I'm gonna do Shade L's of the week. We're gonna, we're gonna have like a little episode of that. But it sounds like you guys love me vlogging. So maybe I'm gonna have some extra vlog content that I'm gonna put out there on the channel as well. But again, smash that subscribe button. We are almost to 30K. I'm gonna be doing a massive giveaway at 30K. We're gonna be giving away three shoes and pairs of socks with them. So definitely smash that subscribe, smash that like if you haven't already. It was so much fun chatting with all of you this morning. Go get some coffee if you haven't grabbed coffee yet. You're right here, Shane. You're not going anywhere. I was doing a premier check. That would be a two minute video, LOL. Is the GS quality good? Yeah, so this is a GS pair for all of you wondering. This is a GS pair. Live streaming is the wave, is it not? Do you prefer to see me live or do you guys actually prefer to see like my edited videos? Would you like actually the combination you have a good day as well Brandon oh thanks MJ's uh, but you know it seems like people are vibing with these lives and I love actually chatting with you guys you know when I'm able to pick up raffles caramel macchiato I love a caramel macchiato YouTube needs both all right I'll give you guys both we'll continue to, to give you both I know this isn't 4k but guess what everybody I got a new Sony camera so, and my phone actually is on 10% battery right now, so let's hope it just doesn't die on us. Thought I charged it last night, but I woke up and it was on low battery mode. Oh, Shade forgot to charge her, her phone. Bad me, bad me. Uh, but yeah, so we're gonna try and do more vlogging stuff. I'm gonna have so much vlogging content for all of you though, because I'm gonna be traveling to LA and San Francisco. Maybe going, you know, to um, Seattle and Portland. We'll see. I have been busy, Daniel. I've, to say the least, I've been busy. And, you know, I still have to make time to hang out with people, which has been pretty limited. 
<laughs> Thanks, CJ Lee. You guys are hilarious. Unfortunately, I'm not drinking a caramel macchiato. I'm a cold brew kind of gal with some almond or oat milk. Aw, you guys are nice. I could use some help being reminded to charge my battery. My battery is on 10% right now, but I'm still hanging in here with all of you this morning, seeing how long I can get my, my phone to last before my phone just shuts off on me. And I can't even charge it right now manually because I have a mic actually plugged in to where I would be charging it normally. Dropping vids when I'm in the fifth dimension of dreams, Joker Harley. I know you guys, it's crazy. I think I might actually just start DJing at night too while I'm, I'm doing these lives. I mean, why not? Why not just go live since I'm already pumping out content at 3 a.m., 4 a.m.? Ah, thanks to Juan for DTX for subscribing to the channel. Just got them for the husband on the Seekers app. Congrats, JJ. They are fire. Have to agree. I get them, I hope. Congrats to everybody who took W's today. Uh, this was a pretty different morning for, I think, everybody. How far would I drive for a pickup? Depends on if I had a car. Uh, I would do well, I think, as a DJ. I'm kind of bummed I didn't go for the Supreme DJ set now. Might have to get that for resale. What is up, Michael McClure? Good to see you in here. You need a battery pack for these live. I know, but guess what? I can't, I can't charge and use a battery pack because I have a sure mic connected to my phone. Shade House Mafia in the house. Yes. Yes. Should I, should we be become Shade House Mafia? Would you guys actually stay up late nights with me and listen to me DJ? What's up, your text? Bump Paris off the stage. We all know she's not touching the one or the two. This is a true story. If you get that Supreme DJ set for resale, you crazy. I know. It's probably crazy right now. I do have my Supreme mic. So I don't know, maybe we'll do a mixture of me DJing with like my Supreme mic karaoke style. How about that? Only on a Saturday, because you have to you could sleep in, Joker Harley. You'll stay up late night with me. Aw, MJ Shades. Yes, Daniel Martin. What's up, Fabian? Ah, hi, my wife. How are our kids doing? <laughs> I love you, DB. That was, that was a good one. That was a good one. Would you rock Reebok old school pumps? I actually have some Reebok old school pumps. Um, I've got some uh, jound ones, actually, and I think they're fire. They're simple, classic. What's my favorite kind of music? I mean, I like a mixture. Maybe we're gonna have to put a playlist together. I am gonna start for my members actually, putting out a playlist of all the songs that I put in my videos. So for those of you who become a member, you'll have access to an entire playlist of what I use on all my videos. Sneaker collection video coming soon. Now we're talking, yeah, Lord Blackwood. How do you become a member, JJ? So if you click on the join button, it'll show you all the tiers on there. So when you see these shade limits, that is actually one of your badges that you will receive be when you become a member. So the longer you're a member, the faster that speed shade limit will go. So shout out to all my members who have those speed limit signs. You guys are crazy on the road with shade. I'm gonna have to stop you fast ones for speeding too fast. I know a couple of you get it up to 100 miles per hour, which is pretty crazy. Uh, but yeah, if you wanna become a member, be sure to hit that join button and you can see all of the membership tiers and hopefully, <laughs> love Star Trek Lord Blackwood. Yeah, see that's, that's special emoji. So all the members also have access to special emojis that they can use on the channel. So that's one of the perks, so definitely Check out that join button, click it. What's up, Kendall? Glad I'm on the hustle, need to start a baseball channel. Do it, Medic Mike. I'm gonna be vlogging SneakerCon for all of you, so definitely hit those notifications because you're not gonna know when I'm gonna be on live. If you don't have those notifications turned on, you're gonna have to keep guessing and coming back to the channel, so definitely turn those notifications on. What's up from Germany? We got King. ABC07 in the house, uh, but I will be at SneakerCon this coming week, everyone. I'm gonna be going live with Jacques Slade on my channel on Tuesday. So definitely tune in. Send me shoes, please. Zero, zero. Here's the shoe right here. I'm sending all of you guys love with the shoe. 
Young Flacco 23 just subscribed. Again, everybody, we are almost to 30,000. So be sure to hit that subscribe. I'm gonna be giving away three pairs of shoes to all of you to just reward you for being with me since the start of the channel. Yes, it's gonna be Slade and Shade, everyone. Slade and Shade. And I want all of you to help me decide how to pack for SneakerCon on Tuesday. So we're gonna be going through some outfits. I want you guys to style me for SneakerCon this coming week. So hopefully you all have your styling caps on because we're gonna be going through my sneaker collection and trying to figure out what shoes I should wear. Fingers crossed, yes, Slade and Shade. Hawaii in the house, what up Brandy? Good to see you guys all in here. Yeah, the Lely Mays are dropping this coming week. I'll be going for those 14s as well. DJ Khalid and another one. DJ Shade. That's, I think, going to be my DJ name for sure. Uh, so I showed everybody my sneakers earlier, but, you know, why not? Let's show you guys one more time here. So, there you have it. Those are my shoes right here. Kicks for the day. I may actually do a vlog, you guys, with what I'm wearing day to day that you guys can actually go with me because I want to prove to you, for those of you who don't think I wear my kicks, that I actually am in this city rocking these. These are all Times Squared out. And you all know how dirty the floor must be out here in Times Square. It ain't a clean floor in New York, let me tell you something. I'm tired of seeing these girls taking photos in their closets. It's like, do you even wear your kicks outside or do you just rock it in your overly crowded sneaker rooms just wondering just wondering not i we out here we're out here in new york city rocking it <laughs> tourists tourists are surrounding me right now you think they think i'm a celebrity or something i don't think they have a clue who i am as long as all of you know who i am that's all that matters that's all that matters congrats to everybody who took w's on these today Lovely mustard colored box, Monsoor Banana JK. Did the GS pair come with the extra pair of laces? It sure did. So let me show you one more time, everybody, before I log off here. Um, let's just show you what laces these came with. So again, comes with the mustard colored laces, but you're also getting the black and white set of laces as well. So if you're not feeling those mustard, laces you can switch it up and swap out the white or black i feel like everybody has mixed opinions on which laces work best so it's nice that we have the three to kind of work with which is pretty cool not a bad color option lace wise black laces all day of course i love going live with all of you i love doing my coffee with shades as much as i can um i'm gonna be starting up supreme again this coming week but, uh, you know, probably not gonna be able to have my lookbook out because I'm not gonna be in the city, but we'll see. Got a W for the GS. Congratulations, Cash. Congratulations to everybody who took Ws today. I'm gonna be signing off here in about two minutes. Been on with you for almost an hour. You guys, I actually went on live for like a solid five minutes. No one was in there until I realized that there was something wrong with my live. I was like, where is everybody? There's nobody in here today. <laughs> Aw, appreciate it, Abbott. Really appreciate it. I want to give you guys the highest production that I possibly can when I can. Shea TV is all about quality, and I can't wait for you guys to see my new content on my new Sony camera. Ah, appreciate it, Fabian. DJ Hot Sub rocking that heat. Tell them the tourists. Yeah, all these tourists are staring at me right now. Times Square is filled with tourists, just so you know. Not a lot of locals hit, hanging out around here except for me. Not a lot at all. So smash that like if you hopped into today's live. Again, it was so much fun chatting with you all. Coffee with Shade. One last sneak peek of this shoe. Beautiful color, nice mustard color scheme, real high quality. And uh, today I'm gonna be doing, you know, it's kind of creepy actually. I'm seeing these guys in the video behind me and it looks like they're actually walking at me. I'm like, oh my God, what is that? What's just going on there? Uh, so definitely hit that subscribe, hit that like. We're about to hit 30K and I'm giving you all sneakers because that's how much I love my fans. Uh, again, hit that join button if you want to become a member. 
Stay tuned with those notifications because I'm going to be doing a styling video this evening on these. And uh, I want you guys to see what these look like lifestyle wise. So I want you to see how I rock them and style them. There's some crazy people out here. This guy's like not wearing shoes and talking crazy things. Welcome to New York. <laughs> All right, everybody, that's it for this Coffee with Shade. Enjoy the weekend. Hope that you guys are relaxing and chilling and just vibing and having a good time. Again, he's got a pair of shoes, actually, that guy. He got a couple pair of shoes. He was holding them. He just chooses not to wear them. I don't even think he realizes he's not wearing his sneakers right now. Um, guy over here is still passed out as well, just for those of you checking it on him. He is uh, still drooling, still passed out, still surrounded by pigeons. Uh, I'm sure when it starts to heat up, he's going to wake up. But again, thanks so much for tuning in. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go for that L train, actually. I'm going to try and find that Supreme L train this weekend. So hopefully we'll get some vlogging footage for you guys to see me hopping on that L. I don't actually want to take the train, though, because I don't want to like curse myself with bad luck. But I will take a photo of it. All right, everybody, that's it for this Coffee with Shade. We'll catch you all on the next episode. Stay safe. Have a good weekend. You guys rock. Hit those notifications again because we got a lot coming on. All right, everyone. See you later.